y'all. We just got these uh, test meters for our water, and uh, we're going to check them out. One's for uh, contaminants, the other one's for pH. These things are kind of easy. You're supposed to rinse them off, which we've already done with distilled water. And when you're done using them, you're supposed to rinse them off with distilled water again and uh, let them dry and then put them away. I've already used these, so I know that they work right out of the package. There was no battery to install. Uh, instructions were pretty much uh, clear. I mean, as much as it could be. Well, anyway, let's uh, let's test them out. All right, we got some fridge water. We haven't used the fridge water probably in about, I'd say at least two years. And we have a what's called a side by side with a uh, ice maker. Everything is uh, works. The ice works. The water works. Everything. Anyway, this came right out of the fridge, and as you can see, it's even got a yellowish tinge to it. It's been in there so long. So uh, we're gonna test for the contaminants first. right around 263 264 uh, when you submerge this they say that you're not supposed to submerge it past the submergible line well in the instructions I couldn't find any place or anywhere on the device where it's a uh, any type of indicator of a line so I just basically go by this and I mean that's the best that I can do since that's where the electrode is so anyway that was fridge water This is uh, regular old tap water, no tinge to it. Tap water at 138. And this is tap water down here in Evansville, Indiana in the 47712 zip code. This is uh, bottled spring water, uh, Walmart brand. leveled off around 233 that's almost a hundred more than our tap water we pay a dollar a piece for those this is bottled distilled water Walmart brand this comes in at 50. Now as you can see all I'm really doing is shaking it off which is all that you really need to do so far as I've seen and the same thing this has already been used so I know that this works and it was rinsed with distilled water before it was put away and like I said, this is the pH meter. This came in a two-piece set. And again, I'm assuming without saying that this is the submerged line, so I won't go any further than the electrode just to be on the safe side because there's, there's no indication of what the submergible line is. So, like I said. Now, pH 7 is neutral. And if I'm not mistaken, 14 is the highest alkaline that you can have. Uh, bottled spring water first. Seven sixty one. Bottled distilled water.
it's actually below 700 so or excuse me below 7 so that means it's acidic it's already below 600 and it just keeps going I'm just going to go ahead and say it's about 550 that's distilled water this is the fridge water that comes from the tap that's been sitting around for about two years comes in at 720 just a hair above neutral and that's after sitting in a fridge for about two years inside of a fridge filter and the last one is the tap water right in about 751 just a hair above uh, just a hair better alkaline than what was uh, sitting in the fridge for about two years so what this tells me is is that my tap water is actually safer than my bottled water that I've been drinking which is basically what I've been seeing on all the uh, YouTube videos and stuff where people's talking about alkaline and and contaminants in their water so I can definitely say that my increase in my water bill in my sewage either way I say it's well worth it I actually started drinking the tap water about 15 minutes ago I would definitely say that this uh, this review item would probably be well worth the money uh, it also came with uh, two pouches with uh, pH and uh, I think it was test test powder but you could add or subtract pH or add or subtract uh, the acidic properties of your water but uh, and you could probably test it too that's probably that's probably really what it is is the tester but this here this is the proof I'm not gonna rely off the color of a powder this is a digital means of telling me exactly what I'm what I'm dealing with here and I can definitely say this is gonna be well worth the money gives you peace of mind have a good one